tea bag. Tea bag. Tea bag. Ah. All right. That is very fucking cool. That is cool. Oh, this is so cool. Uh Yeah, so also I'm still having those damn high encoding options. Ah! Calm down, we're safe. Oh, it's really disconcerting <laughs> popping in and out of existence like that. <laughs> really now. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course, is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo <laughs> transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Hmm. Uh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. I had to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us a chip. You came to turn with that really easily, Simon. Oh, I'd be freaking out still. I mean, granted, there's a whole lot of nonsense happening here, but God damn, man. What? Oh, that. I have no choice. I'm... I know exactly who I'm going for. But yeah, no, I'm having... I, I think my CPU is failing, and I don't like that. I don't like it at all. Because I've reduced my settings for recording my webcam. Hopefully you guys haven't noticed too much, but... Oh my god. It's ridiculous. I tried switching the setting over to a different recording codec. Hopefully that helps and fixes the problem, but... Got it. Come on. Looks okay, right? Yeah. No. It'll do. Boom. Oh, come on. Where are you going? Grab <laughs> Yeah. Come on. There you go. Hey. Don't just drop that. What the hell? Why would you do that? I hope this works. Did you a favor, bro. Did you a favor. God. I really cannot wait to get my new computer. Really can't wait. There we go. Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We'd, we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? 
guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, yeah, sure. Gee, thanks for your uh, compassion, Catherine. God. This is really weird to me. This is freaking cool, though. I really like this. This is awesome. Ah, uh, I'm really having fun with this now. I pressed the switch. What more do you want from me? Oh. Well, it's just a data buffer. Of course you do. I wanted to let you know that I know. You didn't blindly pick me out of the herd. The slow waves of Delta crashing against the shore have an undertow that pulls you into a slumber. It's a beautiful thing. And I won't be selfish. Oh. I think I just ruined it, but whatever. That was really weird to listen to. It sounded like somebody was sexually whispering in my ear and I I yeah can, I, can we please Thanks. there we go okay I just a dumb dumb Whee! Man. want it let me back up here. Let me back up. Please. <laughs> I want to be different. I want to be different. You can't keep me down. Oh, that's so cool. Can I jump off the edge? Do I dare even try lest I actually be able to? <laughs> What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> really good back there, Simon. We got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Beta. Then we just head inside, grab the dunk back, and head down the abyss. Four thousand meters. That's a long way. We don't have to worry though, because with the dunk back, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. <laughs> That's great. And then, we can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. What? <laughs> oh, sorry. I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, <laughs> we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside Theta, okay? See you soon. You make everything sound so easy and nonchalant. Oh my god.
Well, we're here at Theta now. Strasky, wake up Dr. Masters. We're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? He's had a rough day. Jesus Christ. He's all butchered by structure shrapnel. The bow sure did a number on him. Brandon, flip the panic switch on the seat. I don't want to burn through the oxygen. You're kidding, right? He's fucking hanging on by a thread. We need to move him. Strasky, get the infirmary ready. We need to move fast. Wait. Where are Komarabi and the others? This is all we got. The guest is still at Delta. Emma, I can't do this on my own. Grab the other side. Strask, ready or not, we're coming in. All right. See you soon. Well then. This is getting really interesting. Like, I am really into the story now. I want to find out more. This is really interesting to me. Open. Wow, I just ripped that right off. Come on. There we go. Come on. Ah, you're stuck! Oh, because I gotta pull that out first. Wait, what? Wait, now I... Put that back. Uh, put you in. Ah! Well, come on! Work with me here. There we go! Thank you. There we go. That's so cool! <laughs> oh, we texted. I'm sorry if you guys can hear that on the microphone. I'll try to take care of that as much as I can, but... Really hope I'm not having the encoding issues that I've been having too after I've changed some of those settings. Oh my god. This is cool. Okay. Come on. Thank you. Alright. The Dunmat. Why is that a thing? Hello? Hey. Ah, That's so freaking cool. I want to play this in the Oculus. It would be freaking awesome. I want an Oculus so bad. Why am I frozen? There we go. All better. You're gonna open. Yay! I'm finally back in vibrant colors. Hello? Anyone there? Well. Oh, we found Theta. That's rotten, visceral, and gore. What the hell happened in here? Do I go... Oh, I gotta do something with my Omni-Tool right here. No, oh, access denied. Well, oh, shit. Well, some nonsense went down in here. This is really freaking cool. <laughs> Computer apparently doesn't think so, though. The hell are those sounds? Guessing I gotta smash that open? You're not gonna be heavy enough. You might be, though. Okay. Oh, that 
sound delayed. Okay. Turn on my flashlight. Okay. This this has a very different feel to it from what I imagine went with the Amnesia games and everything. And I played a little bit of the Penumbra, and this definitely feels different than that. Is that a Logitech? Looks like a freaking Logitech. Hmm. I don't like that keyboard. All right. There we go. We're here. We're here. Yep. Okay, great. Time yes, to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will yep. be nothing stopping us when we have the done that. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes <laughs> this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. <laughs> Kat, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself. Yes. Attached to a pro fueled by solar panels, it could survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Overwhelming? Uh, at least it feels worth doing. <clears throat> Here we go. The Dunbat. Ah, oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... Mm, Broken. It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't <sighs> write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure. Let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. Thank you, Catherine. You're mighty helpful. <clears throat> Sending me off to my death. We need to find someone who knows the oh. cipher. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. Okay. So I don't get to take you with me then. Beautiful. Alright. Over this way. Oh my god, shut up with the sounds. What? What? I probably shouldn't go up that way, but that's exactly what I'm going to do. There we are. Oh my god, well this isn't threatening at all. Oh my Where are the people? This place looks deserted. So far. You don't Doesn't say. Make any sense. Theta is clearly the best option for survival. <clears throat> clearly, you weren't the only ones that thought that. <clears throat> oh. Jesus Christ. What the um. hell are you doing? I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. Helps me focus. That's... I, I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. <sighs> Let's just keep going. Okay. Well. The more I know. Okay. This is really cool. This is really freaking creepy. That sound. 
is awesome. Where the hell did they all go? They it all died. Uh, picture, where would you go? Probably Lambda or Omicron. Well, we've seen Lambda already. So maybe Omicron. <laughs> I'm really tense. Okay, well that's not gonna open. It's not gonna open. I'm hearing sounds. I'm worried we won't find anyone. Maybe they all helped out with the Ark. To carry it to town? Well, it seems excessive, but I'm not assuming. That's locked for a reason. Okay. <laughs> Stop that, please. This is really cool. Well, can't go down there. Whoa. That's a sound. Those are all sounds. Good to know. Okay. Well, that's pretty. What about this one? Yeah. I don't really care too much about that one. Error. Error. More pictures. Cool. Cool. Let's go to the bathroom. That'll end well, right? It's interesting. Seriously, how'd the flies get down here? I don't understand. They aren't underwater creatures. What up? Nothing. Can, do you mind? Yeah, well, that was fairly pointless. What the hell's that? Nothing. All right. Hmm. Deodorant. Ugh. And, oh, the light's not coming back this time, huh? Boy. Okay. Nothing in those. Ah, it doesn't sound like I am alone. Wonderful. Hello? Mind keeping it down, please? Huh. <clears throat> Interesting. Okay. Yeah, so that light's not coming back this time. Okay. There's a jump scare waiting for me over here somewhere. I don't want to open any of those. I'm just gonna keep walking. Shut up. Hear you. Are you out over this way? 
Or are you in one of those rooms? Um... Oh... <sighs> I don't like this. Shut up. Let's start with the master's chambers. Nope. Nope. I'm gonna leave that pneumatic seal on there then. Okay. Let's try Catherine. Hey, that's my room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Huh. Interesting. <clears throat> Journal. Emojin Reed tested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive. Damn it. I'm gonna close that. But more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way, like someone had specifically created it for WoW to steal. When activated, the machine mimicked the room and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as a simulation inside of the digital space. The presentation shocked Reed and was quickly terminated. It scares me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. Oh. That's in 2103. After dissecting the Vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear that WoW copied my capsule project to construct the scene to hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar in its construction, except for one point. Where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs, the Vivarium's brain scan lives on. It isn't limited by its content. From the originating brain scan, Reed, Reed emerged. The Reed inside the Vivarium was a perfect copy. Ooh. I have it. I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Fapathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked with the Vivarium, but I can replicate WoW's scanning technique using the pilot seats. They are already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. Okay. It was even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to allow the diffraction and high energy needed to con needed to capture the scan. I suspect WoW has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the Mockingbirds. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and use it as a basis for intelligence in the machines. Interesting. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we have now officially started the ARC project. We are to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule. Then we will launch it into space using the space gun. It's nice to think something will live on like that. <sighs> Sorry about that. Hey, right. Mark Serain killed himself after a scan. He has been suggesting everyone should kill themselves, as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the Ark. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff, and apparently it's my fault somehow. Strohmeyer is not happy with me. I hope it will calm down soon. Interesting. In our capsule. Richard gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before. Unfolded one of them to make a new friend for Capsule Catherine and her gang of legacies. New way to simulate turbulence makes the weather system so much better. Implemented Reed didn't go, and that didn't go well. Uh, new try with Reed. Reed won't play nicely with the others. She is too real. Interesting. Okay. I don't find What's a little projector? Looks homemade. That's my attempt at building a vivarium. It's kind of a proto-arc. 
interesting. Oh. Hey! That's cool! Your teddy bear could use some repairs. Toby always breaks. He's top heavy, so he keeps falling yeah. over. <laughs> That's really cool. I like that. Okay. Okay, what's this? What's with the jump? Looks like something you'd fish out of the ocean. Huh? Oh, you mean... Yeah, that's a part of Reed's vivarium. It's... It, it, it's a long story. Forget it. <laughs> ah, you have a lot of toys. Huh. Oops. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean, Catherine? <laughs> Is there something you don't want me to find in here? <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the hell? What's that? Are those tampons? Get out of here. Skizzers! Uh, let's see. Open. Nothing there. What's this? Just sticky notes. Okay. Cool fan. Thanks. Reminds That's me of Taipei, my hometown. Cool. That was interesting. Getting to know Catherine a little. Okay, anything else? Nope. Nothing else in here. Which means I need to go explore elsewhere now, which I really do not want to do. Unless... Is there anything under the bed? Why is it so dark in here? Is my flashlight dying? That was weird. Uh, nothing under the bed. Doesn't look like, I guess. Sock? The hell? Boots? Mm -hmm. Nothing too significant in there. Okay. I guess we're gonna open the door I don't want to open now. And we back. Oh shit. The fuck? Whoa. Okay. Then. I. Yes. That is weird as fuck. Okay. Computer's missing. I hate those mice. Thing in here. No. 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 Get out of my way. No. No. And no. Okay. Close the door. And for good measure, block it off with a chair. There we go. Look back up to the wow! Ah, uh, oh, yeah. Ah. Ah, oh, yeah. Hi. Uh, now that I've done that, back up. Bring the chair with me for safety. Break the glass though? Is that something I even want to do? 